of the next challenge that I'm going to to, to, to undertake. Um, so obviously most of my videos have an educational theme and we've talked about protein in the past and about what's good about it and what's bad about it and what it does in your body but I wanted to um, to show you something that's going to um, I believe within the next 20 years become mainstream in the, in across the Western world, it's already uh, mainstream across the Eastern world in Thailand and China and places like that. So, without further ado, I'm going to introduce the box that I've just got from a company called Crunchy Critters. So, I hope they're going to like this review. So, you haven't seen what's inside yet, so you can see just as I do. This is what we've got. So, oh, a free lanyard. Let's see, we wear that. Oh, so what have I ordered? I ordered pretty much one of everything. The only thing that I couldn't get was the uh, was the tarantula. And hopefully, if they like the, this video and they see the video, they might send one to me. Um, so, bamboo worms. If you have a look inside of there, they look pretty, pretty tasty. Oh dear God! Giant water bugs. But if, if you actually take a look at them, oh, actually, in fact, I'm going to leave those for later. These are, um, so these are queen weaver ants. So if you have a look at those, now when I say these will be mainstream in the future, I don't mean we'll be eating things that look like bugs, but I believe that the protein in them will be used um, to make other things. So I think we'll smush them all up and we'll make them into burgers and chicken nugget style things. I don't know what you'd call them, bug nuggets, I suppose. But oh, these are pretty nasty. These are sago worms. These look pretty grim, I have to say. Ooh. Then we've got some mixed critters. So we've got, ooh, great for parties, pranks, and bush tucker challenges. So, the, oh, oh, I love the fact you can see them in the back. Oh, tasty. So we've got mealworms, crickets, buffalo worms, and locusts. Those locusts look delicious. Put them over there. Oh, June beetles. Oh, they are naughty. Oh, look at these bad boys. Oh, who's going to take those down? Then we've got some, I don't even know how to pronounce that, chipotlins, lemon chipotlins. So these are, these are dried grasshoppers, these are Mexican. These, they look, actually look quite tasty, to be fair. Compared to some of them. Um, so we've got some wild black ants. Oh, we've got some queen leafcutter ants. So these are actually really big ones. Oh, they look tasty. And then we've got some silkworm pupae. They don't look too bad. And then we've got an Asian forest scorpion. Um, and thankfully it still has all of its bits and pieces, look, you can see it in there, 
That looks pretty tasty, but the one, the one that I don't think I'm going to be able to eat <laughs> is the giant water bugs. And I'll show you why in a second, because they're not little, they are actually giant water bugs. Ooh. So, whether or not I'll be able to eat them, I'm probably going to eat them over a series of maybe three videos. I definitely couldn't eat them all at once. Um, I probably couldn't eat five at once either. So maybe, of course, three videos and hopefully I'll be able to eat them. So, I've shown you them. The only thing that's left is to make the videos and kind of eat them. So, wish me luck.